be safe to keep your horse here if you have one. I don't. I have a little carrot donkey. If you harm Arundi, you'll regret it. I'd not care what you do, but you have to think about what's right. You know, you shouldn't really openly profess your support for the rebel when you're in the middle of a guard camp who can pretty much make an example of you by killing you. Anyway, false information is yours. Havana, Tito and those soldiers look busy. Do you know what's going on? So, Tito is personally leading the raid. Hmm, I see. I was just asking because I've never seen him out on the battlefield, but he picked up his weapon. Looks like you're heading off with them. Be careful. I was thinking of an old friend of mine for a moment. Yes, that's lovely. What is with that head garment you're wearing? It looks weird. So, so Havana, Tito will personally lead the assault on the stronghold. Sorry, the assault. The assault on the stronghold. Interesting. Looks like things will be get busy soon. Get busy? Never actually weird, weird phrasing. Since Aguel and I had trouble containing himself upon hearing the news of Taito's appearance in battle, pretty sure he managed to deliver the message to Alrundi. I just noticed one of your eyebrowly looking things actually sticks up. I, have I ever noticed that before? Oh my god, his teeth make sound. That is irritating. Let's go to the location where Arundi will show up. Who knows? Arundi might be the same as us. Or not. Okay, so let's go kill Arundi. Or. Not him, but. Uh, the, the version of him that is. What's the word I'm looking for? Possessed? I think that's the word I'm looking for. Oh my gosh. I swear the donkey would have been marginally faster. This is fine. We'll just traipse on up to the castle. Oh my god. Oh my god. You know, I get I get that you've got really short legs compared to every other character, but you think you'd have some sort of magic steroid speed that would sort of make up for it. Because holy hell it's hard to get from point A to point B with a shy. Even with steed. They really like to make life difficult for us, don't they? Come on, girl. So close. We've almost reached the castle. Barely. Barely reached the castle. Yeah. They want to get in my way, so, you know, I'll humor them. And take out this tower while I'm at it. Bye bye! Oh, did you hear him as he fell? Oof. That was dark. Over there. Wow, this is good. They're nice and alert. Exactly what you want in uh, guard soldiers. We're just going to kill everybody as we go. Too far out. Oh well. Or at least killing people. Anyway, this way. Ah! I spawned in uh, quite abruptly. So, down and left seems to like make the, the firing go sideways as opposed to forward. It's not particularly efficient, so... See? Like that. It goes sideways. It's kind of weird. It's kind of annoying at the same time. Please get just a little bit closer. Or not. That's fine. I'll kill you regardless. 
Look at that, we're almost at level 25. Oh, someone else is here. <laughs> Holy shit, I was just about to say one of those. Apparently there's bombs, guys. Never seen them there in my life. That shows how epically observant I am. Oh, I've got no uh, WP. Do I bludgeon people to get that back? Or is that supposed to use the ability I don't use? Because there's literally nobody here. Oh, come on, I tried to avoid that bomb. Did someone else kill them all? Hmm. Oh well. Actually, no, not oh well. How am I supposed to go into battle when I have no HP? Uh, WP. You see, that doesn't regain it for me, does it? Okay, if I attack the cages, I get some back. That's fine. Attack the cages. Okay, I can probably work with that. Okay, investigate the portal. Yeah, I think you just skewered me. God, we're in slow mo. We'll just do a bit of spin spins around him. Boom. Are we going all the way back? Ugh, but I only just got here. Ooh, treasure chest. Ooh. That's a portal. I can't open it. I'm sure I can't just beat the crap out of it. Yeah. You know, normal wood would uh, break if I did that to it. Apparently it is not normal wood. Oops, I'm sorry, I should free you. There you go, sir. Be on your way. Oh, I miss my lawn. I miss my lawn very much. I didn't see the person whose donkey is there, though. Who do you belong to, sir donkey? Well, let's just go back through these guys. Get all the XP we can. Because why the heck not? worried about what her awakening is going to be like because I'm getting so used to her fighting this way you know I don't want to have to relearn how to fight once she becomes awakened although in saying that I have to say I like my Lan more than I liked Witch and one of the reasons being that I didn't have to try to integrate her old abilities with her new abilities I could just ignore pre-awakened abilities and just use awakened it was it was convenient. I, I liked not having to change between the two and go backwards and forwards and worry about keys for both types and when you're awake uh, when you're on in awakened form and not in awakened form. I could just stay in the one space and just attack to my heart's content. I like that about Lon. So I guess that would be a good thing for the shy, but then she'd lose her flowering ability because. She uses a loot when she's awakened, so I, I think she's going to be one of the ones that has a dual attack. Like, you'll have to use the flooring and then you'll use the awakened loot and then you go back to the flooring. I don't know. It all seems very complicated, but it doesn't really need to be. I don't seem to be getting as much XP from these guys now since I've leveled up a little bit since being here so I may have to refrain from killing them and just move on I mean unless they're coming at me in which case I'm happy to kill I mean if they're gonna come at me you may as well give them what they want well, I suppose what they want is my death but whatever they're asking for death as well it's just so funny watching her me <laughs> Here. Okay, I'm done. I promise.
Go, little shy girl. Use those tiny, tiny legs. Well, actually, since I don't need this necklace. Oh. I don't remember any of these things. But you can have the shoddy pickaxes. Uh, I'm assuming you were going on the marketplace. I don't know what I was doing. That. I got a lot of Algerian stuff. Is that just because of the quest? I think it's because of the quest. Okay, well, an Amerigo shoes. That's great, but you can have those as well. I was keeping the talus though. That much I remember. So, let's just commit. Get rid of that. Is that at 100%? No! Eesh! It needs to be repaired. Does anyone here know blacksmithing? Probably not. It's fine. So the Egerian shoes. Yeah, everybody's just putting a shit in the marketplace now. As a result of this shy. Mm. It's kind of frustrating. I'm not getting much for any of it, but that's absolutely fine. And back to Hervano Tito. No need to be you managed to defeat our really? Country. A long-lasting right? rivalry has finally come to an end. All well, that's left now is to drive out the remaining rebels. Looks like we'll be able to wrap things up thanks anymore. to you. As for myself, I might even be able to rank... Maybe, bleh, be able to make rank. Is that usually how you rebels. phrase it? Make rank? Eh, uh, okay. I'll right assume it's correct. Cheeto. Eastern Gateway Battle Report. What? You haven't left yet? I'm busy interrogating the rebels, so you can report to Crewhorn Wormsbane in my stead. Don't forget to mention my accomplishments. You know what I mean? Here, take us a report with you. Yeah, you're a bit of a douche. But like... Where's the part where you find out that Arundi isn't actually dead? Or that you, you choose not to kill him and then you find out he was possessed? Is this not a thing anymore? I, d I don't understand. That was a thing. That used to be a thing. And now we just kill the villagers' saviour and, and no one seems to give a shit. How is this... What? This can't be right. Well, let me just swing by the castle ruins for a sec. Because this just seems strange. Nope, there's no dude up here going to tell me that he's Aurundi and he was possessed and blah blah blah. This is just so bizarre. Like, that's the quest I got the first time I played this game. And merely we didn't have the Crossroads quest. In fact, this was the first of the Crossroads quests we ever got. We had to choose between saying and lying that we killed Aurundi and protecting him, or actually killing him and supporting Havana Tito. Yet, that doesn't seem to be a thing this time around. You just kill the possessed Arundi and you seem to move on with life. And that's just the spy up there. He doesn't count. That's just weird. How is this a fulfilling quest line? I don't feel very fulfilled at all. I feel quite... Ah, fucking god damn it. Oh well, I think we managed that brilliantly. Nice work, Kia. But, uh, that's definitely... Hollow. It's it's a hollow quest. I. I mean, normally I'm sure it's fine. Normally, if you hadn't really been exposed to the reality of the situation already, because you wouldn't understand the fact that Alrundi is actually good and doing what's best for the people. You would just assume that he's bad, like all the other bad dudes in the area, and move on with life. But I know that Alrundi is not necessarily a traitor. He's doing what he can to support the people of Serendia and rebel against the, the higher forces that would oppress them and so forth. And he was possessed by, I think, black spirit energy or something. And it's so weird that that's not a thing this time around, even though this is a, a crossroad quest, sort of focusing on different aspects. Oh god, that's really bright, the reflection. Um, compared to the other crossroad quests, which don't do this, so, I don't know. Holy shit, this is bright. Why did it have to rain right when it's freaking bright out? Oh, this is painful to look at. Oh my god. Oh, crew horn. Just 
smash through absolutely everybody in the area. How you going, buddy? Don't show your back to the enemy. Never. I mean, it kind of goes without saying, but thanks for the pro tip. I don't want quests. Yeah, see, I should probably uh, get to know him a little better and get these sort of knowledgey things, but not today. One day I'm going to have to just go through all the characters in all the cities and all the little provinces and get go on a knowledge hunt. I can't really be bothered though. Oh, so you're the one who took charge in driving out the rebels. That was resolved much quicker than expected for you and me both, buddy. I've heard that leader was well known for his exceptional skills in combat. But it seems he was no match for you. Yeah, you're not wrong there. The Grand Chamberlain has been quite busy dealing with other matters, but I'm certain he'll be happy to hear that matters at the Eastern Gateway have been dealt with. Lesson the only thing that matters. I was going to report to Grand Chamberlain Never Jordian. Then I thought about it and felt that it would be better if you made the report personally. Oh, huh. well that's nice of you. The Grand Chamberlain has shown quite some interest in you after hearing about your achievements. Feels like we finally found someone worthwhile. Ha ha. Okay. I have a helmet I can sell. Fantastic. Wow, rude much? Bringing that thing indoors? I'm giving my best endeavors to represent Heidel. Say you saw the hardships of the farmers. Did the farmers ask you to tell me this, or are these your own thoughts? It doesn't matter either way. I fully understand their plight, but if Heidel falls, they won't even be able to enjoy life as it is. I am fighting for all Heidelians and the right they deserve. And if that dream comes true, their suffering will not have been in vain. As long as you're yeah, not I don't agree with that. You're welcome to stay here as long as you Small wish. sacrifices are inevitable when you're trying to rewrite history. I fought hard to be where I am today. Yeah, but you haven't sacrificed anything. It's the poor villagers that are doing all the sacrificing on behalf of you and your ideals. Hoping for a day when I can instill my own version of justice onto all. The struggles I've had to face are unimaginable to people like you. Wow, you can fuck off right now. Do you believe that your fight is for Heidel? No, that's not important. You'll probably side with the highest bidder. Ouch! I'm not that mercenary. Consider my request carefully before agreeing. If you side with me, you fight for Heidel. It is recommended a new to mission. I wish to believe that you continue to fight for Heidel, and I'm certain that doing so will benefit you as well. That's why I would like you to resolve the situation at the extraction mill. I have a man on the inside tasked with disrupting operations there, but Calfion have sent their own informant there, making things rather difficult for us. His name is Dawson. He's quite arrogant, but naive, so he shouldn't be too hard to deal with. Take this document with you. It's about a plan I'm preparing. Find Romano Prospero at the northern... Sorry, that was the northwestern gateway. Tell him I sent you. He'll tell you where Dawson is. I would give my life for Heidel. That's lovely. Oh. Oh, oh. A Bastia Viticlati. But the one I have is so pretty. A 3.5 AP bonus. That's awkward. That's kind of cute. It reminds me of a... Uh, like a solar system-y kind of thing. Wait, let's go find... Really? Find my donkey. And... Northwestern Gateway. Ugh. It's kind of far away. I guess you guys will be uh, skipping the journey. You are so white. Oh, I suppose it goes with your skin, doesn't it? But that white's real bright. Real bright. Ooh, pretty horse. Ooh, we're at the Naga Marsh. That's right, we'll be going up against Naga over here. It's not the pretty desert Naga, though. No. Romano Prospero. That is quite the dark beard you've got there, sir. I heard they were sending someone. Is that you? Good. Since we don't have a lot of time, I'll cut to the chase. The Grand Chamberlain gave us an order to follow without raising the attention of others. It's become a bit of a headache, and it's an issue we can't deal with ourselves. However, I think it's a perfect job for a mercenary like you. Okay. Extraction Mill Manager. The extra this extraction mill is managed by Dawson. By the way, you know that Dawson's from Calpheon, right? You didn't? The Republic of Calpheon constructed this huge mill to exploit all of our resources. Thanks to this, the water near the extraction mill has become polluted. And there are tons of work to handle from my end. There are tons of work to handle. I should get a medal from Lucrucio. Ha ha. For doing your job? Okay. Since you mentioned that you were sent by the Grand Chamberlain, I'd advise you keep the part about gunpowder a secret from Dawson. There's gunpowder here? Well, that's news to me too. You need company from time to time. Deliver Jordan's message to Dawson. I will do. 
But I'm not quite sure what this is about. Uh, Gunpowder. I thought they were just mining blackstone here. What's going on? Did the Grand Chamberlain send someone again? I've already said this many times. Tell him we're going to hold off on trading black crystals. We don't even have enough black crystals to send to Calpheon. Going to regret sending me here. Who do we go to now? Oh, we just go back. Okay, well, how could you not do that yourself? It took like two seconds and required zero tact. I don't see why you couldn't have done that. I'll acknowledge you oh, so the plan is to propose a secret deal with Dawson to draw their attention and make them nervous. Guardian this is coming out of nowhere, but okay. Grand Chamberlain Jordian, he's so resourceful. The Grand Chamberlain rarely places his trust in people. I have high hopes for you. It makes one of us. The whereabouts of the gunpowder. It's going to declare war. Is the Chamberlain serious? See, this just comes out left of field. Like, what are we even talking about? I don't even know. Calfin has already filled many key positions of authority with its own people. They will definitely figure out what's going on. Ugh, what a mess. I thought this act of sabotage was just supposed to dent Calfion's pride, not trigger an all-out conflict. Talk to Delano D. Lanoa. He's the one who hid the gunpowder. You need company from time to I'm, time. I don't know if this is a translation issue or whether it was just poorly written to start off with. I'm really not too sure. Because I'm really there are so many details it's not supplying you with. It's really weird. Hi. Take caution. There are lots of bombs nearby. Thanks. Gunpowder? What in the world are you talking about? Do you want to see me get arrested? Commander Romano told me to take care of it somehow, so I hid it between the explosives. <gasps> you put the gunpowder between the explosives? Are you stupid? Now keep quiet. No use driving out the Nagas with bombs. Everything is the trouble. Don't go down. Dawson has been coming around a lot lately. He whines and asks me to catch bugs with these bombs. What? I wonder if he found out something about the gunpowder. My heart pounds away like no other every time he comes by. To be honest, does catching bugs for him give me a promotion? Or a raise? It's during times like these that I wonder whether I should just become an adventurer. I should never have listened to my dad when he told me to join the army. Yeah, and it means you've got to fight other people's battles, even if you don't agree with what they are fighting for. I would much rather just be an adventurer. It's helping me to deal with the triangle head lizards and grassback crabs as well. I envy you, since you have at least something to gain from all this. So he hit the gunpowder. Blah, blah, blah. Kill swamp hermit crabs and grassback crabs that Dawson doesn't bother. Oh, I see what you're There's doing there. Do the Only trouble away okay, let's go kill some lizards, apparently. Because we're going to become a lizard murderer. Not salamander lizards. Crab. Bye, crab. Holy shit. Hi, crab. Didn't see you there, buddy. Wasn't there a marking here? Oh, I finished, that's why. Okay, kill grassback crabs. Well, they're supposed to be here somewhere. I'm not seeing any. Are they the ones that sprout from nothing? Okay, there we go. Oh, that was so sorrowful. That's so sad. <laughs> Poor little crab. I sometimes really don't like killing the natural, the native wildlife. It just seems so unnecessarily violent. Realistic, don't get me wrong, but. Take wow, caution. There are lots that's of amazing. Nearby. Good soldiers are hard to come by because everyone with an inkling of talent has decided to become an adventurer. Well, could I be one of them? I mean, if it no floats your boat, buddy, far be it for me to disagree. Yeah, Black Spirit, that's not the best place to be in. Do we really come all the way here to challenge these weaklings? There has to be something waiting for us nearby. Let's ask Dawson for more details. I feel like there's something fresh around here. If you say so. I'm sure Dawson would love us to exterminate something in the area. Something smells fresh here. Okay. Hey, buddy. What brings you all the way Are you to referring to the smell? The foul stench from the Nagas is unbearable. It's not a Unreliable comrades. I had a bad feeling about this from the beginning. Forest. Many were suspicious of my motives the when I started to run the extraction mill. 
Aside from the awful stench, I didn't think the Naga stronghold would be this close to us. To make matters worse, the Nagas have been loitering around the surrounding areas of the extraction mill. Do you think they are here for the Black Crystals? We can't concentrate on our work because of those Nagas. I also can't trust the Serendian soldiers. A group of soldiers went ahead, but I haven't heard back from them. So we're defeating the Nagas and the Naga Axemen, and we need to find the stranded soldiers as well. Easy to do. I'm small and nimble. I am all over this. I can swim, right? <laughs> oh my god, I might have to swim. Look at how high it comes up on me. I'm practically breathing underwater. I am breathing underwater. Wow. Someone didn't think this through clearly. This is so silly. Look at me. I was practically underwater. Ah, rock. Where are these soldiers? Is this going to be the soldier location? Or is this just going to be things to attack location? Does it sound weird because I'm in water? I don't know, but it sounds very bizarre. Albert of the Swamp Ornament. Where are these soldiers at? Wow, he came from a long way over. Where are these soldiers at? N what? No, they have to be at one of these locations, surely. Ah. There we go. Th no, th those aren't soldiers. From a distance it looks like they might be, but it's really not. Are they over here somewhere? Hmm. I just thought they might be around the uh, structures. But they're not here. So where the heck are they? Okay, it's two locations. Oops, no, that's not what I wanted. I was trying to hit M for that. I think location number three. Where's that? I see. Like this. Oh, they're up top. Okay, my original idea was right. I just didn't see it through. So I do have to go upstairs. If she ever wants to use a ladder. Mm -hmm. Hi guys. I can help you out if you like. We can we can depart this place. You see me a bit sunburned up top, buddy. Thank you for coming to our rescue and getting rid of those nagas. I intend to fall back once our once the wounded soldiers recover. Actually, I haven't seen you around the area before. Are you the mercenary everyone has been talking about? That's me. Wh where they are looking. The nagas are acting suspiciously. It looks like the Nagas have no interest in the stranded soldiers. They're distracted by something else. I wonder what they're up to. Oh, we need to kill some more. Yippee. Bye. Bye. I was actually trying to jump, but sure. I want a lot of them. I want to use my flutter by attack. Come on, team. Let's go. Oh, you can't even see the butterflies because it's underwater. That's less fun. Way to spoil my fun game. Ooh, there's a lot over here. And let's go around. Roll. 
Oh, it's one of these dudes. Follow someone attacking me. Have you noticed how the eyes are locked in that island in the middle of a swamp? I, I haven't, but you know, I suppose you're more observant than I am. Ooh, gifts. And we're being attacked. A bronze key. What the hell am I supposed to do with a bronze key? <sighs> oh, that's what I mean. And another inventory slot. Awakening. Artifacts of the Naga. Do you see that? The Nagas are protecting the artifact. That's what is waiting for us. It's been waiting for us for some time now. Okay. I don't really know what it wants, but... Yay! Inventory space! Yeah, I don't know what it wants me to do with that. At all. Yay! Oh, my pet. My poor pet. Okay, hold on. I'm gonna go feed the pet. She's uh, starving a little bit. I got you. I got you. I don't got to. I need to buy food. Okay, I need to get out of this friggin' swamp. Let me just get to this island. I can't multitask when I keep getting killed. Killed. Attacked. You know what I mean. Are you coming? You coming? You coming? Thanks for the XP, gentlemen. Level 26. Purchase. Feed. Of the organic variety. Even though I don't really need organic feed. Ah, uh, 30. Uh, 26, because I'm poor. Again. Forgot about that. I will take all of it, please. Guts to feed my kitty. Yay. Okay, what are we doing here? We're just investigating the energy. Am I, am I actually killing something? Hey, yes, it's here. Am I killing anything or just saying hi? Little column A, little column B, apparently. A guy called Aiden saved me. Those black Nagas went berserk as soon as they saw the artifact. Where's Aiden now, though? Oh, there he is. Oh, this is where Aiden kicks butt and we're just like a passive together. spectator. Oh, damn it. Words are no use here. Why can't this be the kind of game that has romance options? Come on, Aiden. It's just a naga. You Your can do it. For a false power. We'll put everyone in danger. You. Could you pick up that necklace there for me? The one that's floating mysteriously in the air? Absolutely. They are our danger. The Falcons from the desert pushed us here. But the spirits of our king call to us from within the artifact. Its power will allow us to regain our homeland. I mean, you can't really argue against them. Your plan cannot be saved with that artifact. Why not? The power is that of destruction, oh, not of salvation. Well, that's what he wants to do. He wants to destroy the Fogans. <laughs> what a thief. What an absolute thief. Just by all means, Black Spirit, go screw over the poor Naga. It's not the Naga's fault that they were pushed out of their land by the Fogans. Poor little Naga, he looks so sad. Can they see the Black Spirit? I don't think they can, can they? Okay, well that was illuminating. 
Who are we going to go see now? We're going back to Dawson? No, we're going to speak to Yaz. No. Aiden! Alongside the dead Naga that disappeared. Oh, you reappeared. Ah, it's you again. You've grown surprisingly powerful. I see that you're still under the influence of that black energy. I hope you don't fall prey to its powers. I suppose this is the silver lining. He just disappeared. Bye, Aiden! I feel better now. You're happy too, aren't you? Romana was looking for you again. Should be something exciting, don't you agree? Not really, but whatever. That's great, I'll take your reward. And there we go. I've got to summon him again. Why? There we go. Now we're done. Find the Romana Prospero. Alright, we'll go back on foot. That's fine. Um, I've got a lot of things I can sell. I need to find a storage dude for that. And then... How about of the Swamp Ornament? Well, that can go in the marketplace. And that's from... Uh, Attendance to don't need. That's great. Uh, cool. Let's head back. Oh my gosh. We've been given the gift of speed, have we? Because hell, we're fast. Why can't we be this fast normally? I like it. What about the enemy? Hmm, there's something different about you. Never mind. I think the awful stench from the extraction mill is getting to me. The Red Barbarians. The Grand Chamberlain has assigned a new task to you. It's not typical for the Chamberlain to trust an outsider, so don't let him down. Your next task will be to fight against some Red Orcs. Go to the Southwestern Gateway. Captain Xavier Vitello is expecting you. Southwestern... Western? <laughs> Southwestern... Southwestern region of Serendia. Okay, ooh, we got a weapon box. Good, because I, I need some weapons. Where is the weapon box? D d am, I, am I blind? The only box I see is the wagon one. A what? It legit just said I got a weapon box, did it not? Am I imagining things? Or did I just get the weapon? Oh, I got the weapon, not the box. It opened it automatically. Oh, it's not as good as the ultimate styed flooring. That's sad. But fine though, I suppose. The Bastia, yeah, they require bus Bastia black stones, which are much harder to come by. Okay, we'll move on, Kia. We'll keep our ultimate flooring. Anytime you want to mount would be fantastic. Thank you. How far away are we going? Oh, that's actually not that far. Oh, shit, we're stuck. Zeviaro. There you are. Yeah, something sounds swampy back there. Oh, it's you. You're not swampy, you're uh, spidery. There you go. Situation is taken care of. Red orc. Sworn enemy to Oh, me. I remember this dude. <laughs> My foe. What Lord Julian personally recommended you? Impressive. Good to know that you're on our side. On this land. Do I need Cliff's no story? Do I already know Cliff's orcs. story? I have no idea. Cliff? Holy shit, let's start Captain that again. Trouble at the seen. door. Lord Julian has instructed us to wipe out these red barbarians from all of Serendia. But unlike the Fogan and Nagas, the red orcs are much more violent and organised. It's difficult for us to carry out a full scale attack because these red orcs are so persistent. What is with the formatting with this thing? The Grand Chamberlain may have recommended you. But you'll have to prove your competence before you can earn my trust. We're having difficulties containing a bush spider epidemic near the gateway. Please help resolve the situation. If you're able to take care of that, you shouldn't have too much trouble taking care of the red orcs. You know, I shouldn't really have to prove myself. If you want something to get, you know, be killed, then you should just let me go and kill things. If I can kill in the process, that's my problem. How many are we killing? Ten! I'm sure we'll get through this very quickly. Ooh, ooh, it's clusters this way. Clusters! Big bush spiders. Well, where are the big bush spiders located? Oh, the other side, naturally. 
Excuse me, spider. Lizard. Whatever you are. I need to go in the opposite direction. Um, how do I get... Oh, let's go the long way. Yes, there are some here. I was worried that there wouldn't be any. Ew. That's some serious webbage. Oh my god, it's so big and ugly. Six to go. Oh well, at least we're eradicating the world of these spiders. That's that's positive, right? Start heading back. I don't want to get too far out. Probably got a trillion spiders following me at this rate. Just the two? Okay, they're not even coming for me. Great. And there we go. Bye, spiders. I don't think you give me watching the way of XP, so I shall let you live another day. Yep, bush. I still find it hilarious how all the bushes are like taller than Shy. <laughs> I know that my Shy character is apparently very small and that was unintentional. She's very small for her, her race. But yeah. I don't know that the grass is meant to be as tall as she is or taller. Red Orc swore enemy to oh, me. he just says the same thing. Fighting that hesitation. Battle. I'm impressed. Was it too easy for you to handle? Don't you worry. We're just getting started here. Okay.